What's up ladies and gentlemen, it is Razor from Suited Entertainment and today I'm going to be showing you how to use the GTA 5 trainer. However, this one is online. Uh, a friend of mine ported it over so basically it works on GTA Online instead of just single player. So first of all what you're going to want to do is download this. I've put the download link in the description. These are going to cost you about £5 but trust me it's actually worth it. You should probably send it by uh, PayPal or something like that anyway, but uh, it'll be in the description on how to do it. I might offer some other ways of doing it, it depends on if I can find some. The uh, text file is there just for you guys, just to make sure, in case you don't understand what I've said, or whatever, just basically, you know. Uh, grab them three files, and what you want to do is go to your Grand Theft Auto 5 directory so it should be something along the lines of C program files Rockstar Games Grand Theft Auto 5 so this is my Rockstar Games folder and in mine I've, I've installed mine on the D drive so just ignore that unless you've done the same or similar obviously um, so you grab them three files drag and drop them into there I've, you don't need to replace them because uh, I do I've already uh, tested them out and then all you want to do is open up your Grand Theft Auto 5 So when you get to this point guys, all you want to do is select online mode instead of story mode. You can still use the trainer in story mode, but this is for online mode. So when you get into GTA Online, you'll notice that, well, nothing has changed. Basically, what you want to do is press F4 and your trainer comes up on the, on the screen. And if you use the number pad keys on your keyboard and you can navigate via that so 8 is up and 2 is down and when you select vehicle car spawner uh, 6 and 4 are navigating left and right however the car spawner doesn't work in online mode you can go to player options if you change you can change your skin I'm not going to do that so I like my skin it's cool uh, you can teleport so example if I set a marker on my screen somewhere I'll set it I'll set it near the guy that's online. Where is he? There he is. Set on the road to this guy. Oh no, he's in fucking plane. Son of a bitch. So anyway, um, set it there, and then you press 5 to select, and you get teleported. As you can see, this guy is about to fly over somewhere over there. Uh, you've got also fixed player, so you can fix your player if he's got bloody skin and whatever, reset his skin. You can't add cash, you can change your wanted level so it goes all the way up, or you can change it all the way down, you never be wanted. So if I change that up, it doesn't work. It can be invincible, but don't abuse that, because arseholes abuse that. Uh, police ignored, I don't know what that means, but I think it just means that the police ignore you. Uh, unlimited abilities used for single player, I think. Noiseless, I'm not sure about that. Fast swim, obviously it speaks for itself. Same for that. Fast run and super jump evidenced now. You can jump high and then you can jump higher. And because I'm invincible, well, I'm not invincible actually. It still doesn't kill me. Jeez. Yeah, tell me about it. Um, but weapons, you can get all weapons. So for example, I've got now I have snowballs in my inventory, fire extinguisher, and you can drop these for your friends but I think it's only for the session that you're in, uh, railgun, one hit kill on everything. Firework launcher if you've not already got one. Uh, musket if you've not already got one. There's all sorts. Cousinberg sweeper. And there's a taser. A stun gun. That's, that's fun online as well. Shoot people. What the hell? Why am I rolling around on the floor? Uh, no reload. Obviously speaks for itself. You don't need to reload. Fire ammo. So you shoot and you, your gun shoots fire. Oh, <laughs> 
fire engines on fire. <laughs> Explosive ammo, again speaks to itself. So for example, I shoot. Explosive melees speaks for themselves, punch someone to blow up. And vehicle rockets, like you do in a multiplayer GTA race. You can get in a car. And let me hit the car, you fucking whore. Let's see if this works. How does this work? How do it? Well, I can't figure out how to do it, but maybe you can. Oh, yeah. Um. Oh shit! Don't worry about it. Uh, when you're inside a car or a fire truck, this would be interesting. You can change the color. That's one thing that does work on online mode and fix. You can fix the vehicle. Don't know what wrapping spawned means, but if you figure it out, let me know. Invincible obviously is basically where your car is invincible. No one can blow it up with anything. But again, please don't abuse this. It's online mode. It's not fair on other people. Just have fun, but let make sure it's have it's fun for everyone else. Speed boost again speaks for itself. It gives you a little speed boost, but. I'm not sure how fast the speed boost is. I mean, I'm going a little bit faster for a fire truck now. Fire engine. Uh, world, not much works on here, but um, I don't know if random cops turning that off, trains and oh, bolts, garbage trucks works, but um, it might work, you know. Uh, moon gravity does work. Works for us, and I think it works for other players. So you essentially got sort of flying cars, I mean you can turn it off and on. Again, don't abuse that too much. If people don't like it, turn it off. And if you figure out it's you, you'll get reported and you'll get banned. So it'll be a waste of money on GTA if you just you know, to piss around. Uh, to annoy people. Time doesn't work. It works in single player, doesn't work here. Pod pause again doesn't work, single piston. All the single player just works, except it's online. Same with this one, doesn't work at all, because everything's server side. Next radio track, I mean, you can do that yourself anyway. It just changes radio and hide HUD, completely gets rid of the HUD. So that's pretty much it guys, so uh, I hope you enjoy. Um, I'll put the download links in the description. Just uh, make sure to like, comment and subscribe with our videos. Uh, there'll be more information, whatever, just uh, get contact us or write a comment or something if you need any more information as well. Um, and uh, yeah, I hope, you, I hope you enjoy guys, just please don't annoy people too much. And if you, you know, if you get reported and banned, we've got nothing to do with that. So see you later guys, thanks for watching.